Oh my gosh, I just had to go through and on the trailer where we put all of that trash, I had to separate it to make it even with the truck that's outside for the big day tomorrow of trash day. Basically, we get free days, um, I think like four or five times a year for specifically stuff like this. So like for home renovations, whenever you're cleaning stuff out and it saves you almost like I don't know, anywhere from 200 to $300 because it's free. So this episode is going to be, I don't even know what it's gonna be honestly at this point because we got so much that we're working on all at one time and it's like each job takes a different person, AKA my dad, my dad can do every job, but we can't. So I'll show you guys, we need drywall for this um, and we need drywall for this, but we really only need one sheet but as you guys already know, I drive a sedan, so I don't think that a <laughs> sheet of drywall will fit into my car. And our sink came in, which is so cool. It's like a little, I don't even know. I don't know what this is called. But as far as that goes, I have no clue what this week is gonna hold, so just stay tuned. We are currently at Home Depot, picking out some supplies and stuff. Whee! I opened it, but I haven't bought it yet. <laughs> but I will. So here are the two elongated toilets we got. And then we got three of these sinks. We ended up having four carts when checking out. That is a stinking cool bathroom vent that we got and I cannot wait for y'all to see it. We loaded everything up and then we headed on over to Walmart to pick up the bathroom floor and this stuff, which will hopefully turn our tubs white. Today it is flipping hot. I'm sweating, I usually do not sweat. And I'm not just saying that, I literally never sweat. But I always like, stink. Not always. Anyways, we are unloading the truck right now and then we're gonna finish up the back room with the drywall. But I want you guys to see how pretty this is. That's gonna be so pretty. So the last day it was just me and I had to finish up the stream room and the bathroom. I don't know why people trust me to be alone by myself. Anyways, I had to cut the door frame out and I tried to do something really cool with this. Be like, honey, I'm home, knocking through the drywall, but I did not have the angle correct on this at all. Anyways, we took the drywall from that and put it where the door was in the bathroom on both sides and we pretty much finished that up. Okay, so I've been at it a little bit today. Uh, my hair feels absolutely disgusting because it's got all that stupid uh, drywall stuff in it. But anyways, I'm gonna show you guys for the last time ever the stream rooms before they're done because I want you guys to be absolutely like, whoa, because I'm gonna tell you right now, it's not, I'm not doing what you think I'm doing with it. So if that means anything. Okay, so the bathroom, you guys will be able to see again. I'm gonna show you guys the bathroom again. You guys will see the progress, but that wall is now completely put in. And here is the stream room. So this one is gonna be JT's, okay? And then this one over here is going to be mine. So this is the last time, y'all, there's where the door was. This is the last time you guys are gonna see this room. I ended up working on the hole in the ceiling in our closet and I just put the first coat of mud on. I have to put several coats on that. Then I ended up scraping off the glue from the bathtub and the master bathroom. And that's pretty much it. Stay tuned for next week. Oh, also, look at our new friend. I love him. If JT kills him, I'm gonna be so sad. Bye.